Okay, I wanted to quickly show you how to update this um, uh, Wix Pro Gallery. It's a uh, photo gallery. Um, when you click on it, basically what we're going to do here is if you want to change kind of the, the density of this collage, um, the layout, uh, or change how many pictures show up per line and so forth like that, what you want to do is click on Settings. When you click on this gallery, you'll have Manage Media and Settings. So click on Settings. That's going to open up the Wix Pro Gallery um, uh, settings area. What you want to do is go here to Layout and then click on View Layouts. You'll see that Collage is selected. You're welcome to play around with any of these um, to see if you like any of them better. They, there's lots of options to choose from. I do like this Collage version. I think it's pretty nice. But let's say you want to change the density of the images in this Collage layout. Then you want to click here on Customize Layout. Um, you'll see here there's a couple options. You can do different orientations. Um, and again, this is all based on the, the, the person's size of their window and stuff and the pictures that you have in here. So you don't have 100% control over exactly how these are placed, but you can certainly play around with these, the orientation of them. And then if you scroll down, make sure to scroll all the way down here because this is where the more important settings are set. Um, there is the thumbnail size. So let's say I have it set at one now, but if I go up to 100, what that's going to do is make the pictures in general quite a bit larger um, and fill up more of the, the page. So this is for the thumbnails. Uh, if you want to have more pictures show up in that, then make your thumbnail size smaller. The other big part of this is this density option. If I go down to 1%, then the density of the collage, meaning like how many pictures per row, kind of decreases. So you'll see these are all now pretty large. If I want to go to the other end of the spectrum, I can go to 100%. Um, and you'll see that that then starts to, to pack them in a little bit more tight. Um, usually somewhere around the middle is a nice thing, but you can certainly play around with it um, and, and get it to where you want it. I'm going to leave it at 70% right now. Now I can go ahead and close this window. Um, if I don't like the way these are ordered or anything like that, that is all done here under Manage Media. I can click here and drag them around to reorder them if I choose. Um, so if you find that some of these pictures are getting enlarged and you don't want them, you can start playing around with moving a few of them to see if you like the placement of them and the, the size of them better. But again, it's kind of uh, it does it automatically based on your settings and kind of tries to fill that space as effectively as possible based on the settings that you have set up. So um, if you like the way this looks, you're great. If not, if you want to keep adjusting it, just come back here to settings, click on layout, go here, click on customize layout. And if you scroll down, this is where you can adjust that collage density and the thumbnail size. You can also adjust the spacing between pictures. So if you want to have more space, um, that's also an option. Uh, I think we had it at 10 on most of your pages. Um, you can also click on load more if you want it to have uh, not show all the pictures right away and load more. Um, we had this clicked off, but that's also an option there. Just to kind of go through some of these other settings, you can actually uh, adjust some of this other stuff, like how you want it to react if they click on it. Right now we have it going to the expand mode. Um, which kind of goes to a, a large version of it that they can view on a white background. You can even customize this page. Let's go back to the editor. I just went into the preview mode and I'm going to click on this and then I'm going to click on settings, come here to advance or to design and then you can click here on customize expand mode and that'll allow you to maybe if you don't want the title to show up or if you don't want um, anything to show up, you can adjust the text that shows up on these. I don't think you have titles on these, so nothing's showing up. But if you had them, you could adjust the text here a little bit. You can also um, say don't display the info um, or hide by default, that kind of thing. So I'm going to leave this as is for now, but I just wanted to show you that if you wanted to expand, customize that expand mode, you can. You can also adjust the overlay. So when somebody rolls over this, you can adjust how dark or light the overlay is. You can change the color of the overlay. Um, so there's lots of options here to um, play around with if you want. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and close out of this. So that's basically, this is the Wix Pro Gallery, and those are some of the basic settings that you have 
um, at your disposal to adjust and make this look a little bit better if you don't like the way it's currently looking. Let me know if you have any other questions.